This is Spinnaker3 here with another amazing Mojo Showcase, and today we're going to be taking on the Cavalier Event Quest Jabari Panther with Mojo. Now, the great thing about Mojo in this fight is that it's very easy to sidestep Jabari Panther with his uh, light animation and his not as long dashback. And Jabari Panther may be able to cleanse debuffs, but the one thing she cannot cleanse is Mojo's passive degenerations. So we're still going to be able to get a lot of damage in this fight, even though she is cleaning our debuffs. And so right here, you'll notice I launched my special two and I only get four degenerations. Now, when Jabari Panther puts an ensnare on us, our ability accuracy actually gets lowered. So you'll notice that right here, I trigger my anti-life field and I don't even get my fury. So this matchup isn't really too ideal for Mojo. I think Mojo does have some benefits that make him very good for this fight. But that's why you'll also see me try and bait out a couple more SP2s instead, because those are also easier to dex. So right here I get hold block, and so I'm waiting for Jabari Panther to go passive, but she doesn't. So I end up just holding my block animation, and now I'm baiting a heavy, and then I go right into her. And luckily, my dex triggers right before she enters the hunt and makes my dex fail. So I was able to get away from that. And you'll notice that I'm landing the sidesteps very consistently with Mojo. I think it's very easy to do this. And I launch another special two. And here it only puts two degenerations. But, you know, those are still doing a lot of damage against Jabari Panther. I mean, this is a fairly quick takedown for one of the tougher Cav event quest bosses, in my opinion. So I, and I'm doing this without the white Magneto pre-fight, which tends to make this a lot easier. And right there, I get the stun prompt, so I quickly stun her. And here I have my anti-life field fury, and I get all my degenerations. So Jabari Panther is just dropping. Like, Mojo's degenerations put in so much damage, so much work. And right here, I'm just trying to get the idle prompt, and she's kind of playing very aggressive, but I managed to get it in the end. And right here, I'm going to try and bait out a special two, and then finish her off. So I'm just waiting out this animation. It has quite a few hits. And right here, I want to back her into a corner. And so I hit against her block to generate some space. And I get pushed to a special three, but that's perfect because I did want a thumbnail image from the special three. And so I launch this with my Fury up. And I dislike Jabari Panther until she drops. So this is going to kill, and she goes down very easily. So if you enjoyed this showcase, please let me know, leave a like and subscribe and comment on what you want to see me take next with Mojo and I'll catch you later.